Hey guys, we are back, Sausage Fingers TCG. We're doing another grading video, this time from GMA. I accidentally stumbled upon them, I believe through Google. And believe it or not, the grading for these was $3 a piece. They say they have a turnaround time of, okay, yeah, these are, this tape's killer. They have a turnaround time of seven days. They guarantee it too. And like I said, three dollars. Anyone who's gotten their stuff graded knows. If you're going with Beckett, PSA. I, I'm, I'm sure even the other ones, you're not going to get them for three dollars a piece. So I figured I'll send out a dozen of these, and we'll see how the grading is. So I sent these, oh, uh, it's been a week, let's see, it's been six business days since they received my shipment, and I already have it in hand. So seven days, they got it to me in seven days. I have no idea what the grading is on these, they did pack it very well. So we are about to find out. Oh, uh, looks like they do not grade magic cards. That's disappointing. Okay. All right. Well, I guess it's a good thing I didn't only send magic cards. I wish they would have really let me know. Hey, we don't grade magic cards. They have listed that they do non-sports. And obviously they grade Pokemon. I believe they even charged me. I will have to look. I will make a note of it if they charge me. Or I'll put it in the comments. Okay, so, that disappointment aside, let's see how these are. I'm going to assume the grading is on the same side. Uh, let's see. So this is one I sent in. I really didn't think it was going to get a 10. But, I mean, $3 a piece. You know, I like these holders. Or, I didn't know if I like these holders. I like the PSA ones. But these seem alright. Let's see, what did I get? I got a 9. Okay. So yeah, I definitely knew this wasn't going to get a 10. But I have seen other people say that they are very giving on their 10s. So this was kind of a, let's see if they are very giving on their tens. You know, I guess that's reputable if they misgrade things. But, I mean, I like these holders. I like these. I mean, three dollars, guys. That is cool. Another thing I've seen people complain about is that the cards shift around in here. Can you hear it? It is shifting around. But it is in a penny sleeve inside here, so it shouldn't damage it. But people complain about that? One second. Let me get my PSA stuff. Okay, I've got my PSA stuff here from my blast order. And I want you to listen. Listen to this. It jiggles around in here too. So, I don't think that's a very good complaint to have against them. So far, I'm happy. I, I, I'm happy. Like I said, three dollar grades. All right, so let's move along. So I kind of sent off a Pikachu theme with this one and something else, but I was getting all my Pikachus graded and they did not keep them in order. Well, the other. Pokemon and I was getting great and this was the uh, Charizards. So, like I said, just trying them. Let's see what I got. A 10. Nice. What is this? This is the Black Star promo. Cool. Alright, so far 1-9, one, 1-10. One, I think most of them were in pretty good condition. I guess pretty good condition isn't very descriptive, is it? I was shooting for 9s and 10s with these, and I just bought the camera. Sorry. 
eating a Milky Way. All right, so Pikachu. Nothing special, he's just a reverse hollow. Like I said, I was just kind of shooting for a Pikachu theme and a Charizard theme. That'd be cool. Let's see, I got a 10 on this. Neat. Cool. Uh, I mean, I kind of like they kept him in a penny sleeve so they won't get damaged, I guess, as easily. No, it's not even in a penny sleeve, it's like in a different type of sleeve. Because look at the way, because the penny sleeves will hang over a bit. Okay, cool. Whatever. Alright. Let's put that there for the tens. Charts are hard. Alright. And, oh, I didn't even sneak it out. Oh, you know, it's a nine. <laughs> this is one of the ones I didn't think was going to get a ten either. That's cool. They didn't put the set names in it. I just noticed that. I just kind of put the... I took the time to type out the... Or write out all of it. Maybe I put the Black Star promo. Same with this one. But that looks like it might be another thing that's not so great about them. Then again, $3. Come on, guys. $3. And I like the cases. I like these cases. All right. Let's remember to hide the grades for suspense. Uh, this is another one I didn't think was going to get a 10. I just accidentally seen it. You guys accidentally seen it, and it's a 10. I want to say that this had scratching on the foiling. There's a piece of fuzz on my thumb. Random. Maybe this wasn't the one. Sorry. Oh. Yeah, I guess I should be looking through here, huh, guys? I was trying to get a closer look. Hmm. It's a 10. I guess that's a thing. Promo. I like this one. I thought it was, it was kind of cute. All right. Let's go with this next one and let's correctly cover it up. Another Charizard. This one's from one of the sets. I don't like that it doesn't say the set name. That kind of sucks. Uh, oh well. It's cool. Three dollars, guys. Three dollars. Let's let's keep remembering that. And we have a nine. I uh, this yeah. You can see right there. This is one of the ones I opened up for my box sets. It's like one I just actually uploaded today. And you could see how bad it was in that video. Look, you can see here. It's dinged up. There's a white spot there. There's a dinghy on there. The dinghy makes it less. So, wait, no. Get in the right stack. Go there. Organization, be professional. Ah, what are you doing here? All right, so. Another Pikachu. Another. Black Star. So cool. And we got a 10. Sweet, Pika Pika. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. And, aha. This is one I really wanted to 10 in. Probably should have. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. But that's cool. I I thought this was a neat card. And it got a 10. Isn't that freaking cool? Last card. There's another Charizard from uh, that set. I actually don't know the set symbols very well, but it's from 2016. Ah, <laughs> oh, I'm gonna complain about not having set symbols all day. It's okay. It was three dollars. It was three dollars, and it got a ten. Nice. So maybe they have a little easier grading scale. Or maybe I've learned that uh, I have a better eye for what's going to get a 9 or 10 or all that fun stuff. I didn't get any 8s at least. I didn't get anything under 9. So I'm happy with that. Overall, I would definitely use this company again. I really, I would encourage you guys to try it. Uh, you might not fetch the same money you know, a, a PSA card would get. Because I think 
PSA may be a more known... Sorry. Uh, okay, can we focus? Jeez, you've been doing so good. Why you do this? So I, I was saying, um, I mean, you might fetch more money on eBay or something for PSA over GMA just because people are, I, I feel like they have some kind of prejudice against anyone who's not PSA or BGS for Beckett. But I mean, really, I mean, it doesn't look bad. I like it and I'll be using them in the future. Now, if I, I pull, like, some money cards, I'll probably end up using PSA for the same reason. If I want to sell it, I mean, I feel like I could get more. But I don't say it in a negative way. I, I guess it is a negative way. But I don't mean it in a negative way. I am very happy. I like these. I kind of like that they're sleeved inside, too. You know, unless chance to ruin your cards. Not that you're ever going to open them. Whereas, you know, PSA, they don't. It's just, it's naked. It's a naked. You don't go naked on the streets. I guess it's in its home. It's okay to be naked. But it's cool. I like it. I like it, guys. So let me know. Would you be interested in sending off to GMA? You know, I believe their website was just gmagrading.com. Yeah, just give them a Google search. GMA grading. Uh, make sure you add the grading because when you find GMA, you're going to be looking up like shorthand for grandma, and that may or may not lead you to the kind of videos you want to see. Just saying, guys. Awesome. I'm happy. I would use them again. I'm just not happy they didn't do my magic cards. Wow. This is an alpha card. Listen in for my buddy. It is tore up, but is the only alpha card. He's had it for a million years. And I thought as a surprise I'd get it graded for him. Even if it was going to get like a doo-doo grade. But you know, just kind of, he doesn't play it. I thought it would be nice. Alright guys. Thanks for watching. Let me know. Would you guys consider using this? Or, if this video encouraged you, let me know. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.